guy was uh, there was a very good man. The opponent was tough. He was making a lot of balls, and uh, in the beginning uh, was easier because I was serving well, and uh, he didn't know how to adjust to my serve. But uh, at the end of first set and the whole second set, he knew how to return my serves. He was making a lot of balls and uh, making me play, and uh, that was very tough. And that's shout out to him. It was a good match. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What was the toughest part of the match for you? The toughest part was, I think, uh, to keep focus on every point because uh, I couldn't let go any point because he would uh, he would take the chance and to break me back as I broke him. Then I relaxed a little bit and he broke me back, back straight away. And uh, you know, moments like this, I had to keep the focus on every ball. Mm -hmm. You will be playing uh, tomorrow in the final against Lukas Klein or uh, Danilo Kalinichenko. Mm -hmm. Do you know these players? Not really. I've seen a few matches when they played here, but uh, I didn't really pay attention because I was. I'm just trying to focus on myself. And, yeah, that's it. Doesn't matter who am I going to play. Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, how do you feel here in Ternava? I've been here. This is my third time here. I've played one 14-year-old event and then one last year ITF. And uh, yeah, I very really like it here. It's a very good club and very good city to be. And uh, yeah, it's, I'm enjoying my time here. And the last question is: uh, You were playing uh, junior semi-final at Australian Open this yeah. year. So how was that experience for you? It was the first time in Australia, yeah, and uh, it was very good. Uh, it was my third Grand Slam and uh, my first main draw win, and then first semi-final. I played well. We did a good job with my coach together with making plan before every match, and yeah, I'm, uh, it was a very good week and good experience. Yeah.